Hi, I'm Mark Gordon with GoldenTicker.com on Sunday, May the 6th, 2012. This is a stock report, stock forecast. This is the NASDAQ composite down 2.25% on Friday on heavy volume, second day of heavy volume uh, uh, as it was dropping. Uh, took out this blue line, the 50-day moving average, on a gap down. Not a good sign. Uh, also took out the red line, the 21-day moving average. Um, volume uh, had increased from the previous day. And uh, on Thursday, volume had increased from the previous day before that. So that is two days of distribution, which signals that institutions are selling stock. So the current trend for the NASDAQ is down. And let's look now at the S&P 500. This is the SPY, the uh, ETF for the S&P 500. <coughs> also down uh, three days in a row uh, on a pickup in volume. And then on Thursday, the volume had picked up from Wednesday's session. So two days of distribution on the S&P 500 as well, losing 1.62% on Friday, slicing through its 50-day moving average and its 21-day moving average. So S&P 500 uh, trend is down now and not looking strong. <clears throat> now, um, the uh, S&P 500 did confirm a new rally on the 25th of April as it gapped up higher. And uh, but this rally has now fizzled out, and IBD is now calling markets back in a correction. So we had a quick little, you know, uh, week and a half, uh, a two-week uh, feeble rally attempt, and now we are back down uh, in a correction mode. And here is the Dow, um, the, the uh, you know the big uh, large cap stocks, American stocks, and uh, uh, it is faring a little bit better, down one and a quarter percent on a pickup in volume, but volume has been low. Um, been low for quite some time here and we are getting support down here near the 50-day moving average but still the Dow is trending lower so even though we did have a follow-through day on the S&P 500 the markets have uh, put in what we call a head fake and are now back into correction mode and in a correction I don't like to buy any stocks uh, I like to wait it out as three out of four stocks will follow the general market so it pays to just sit on the sidelines if you already are in stocks you want to sell your weaker ones especially if they slice through the 50-day moving average or the 10-week line uh, on volume uh, that's a definite sell signal uh, so time to uh, uh, play defense here and uh, raise some cash if you can and what we'll do is wait for uh, a, a follow-through day. Uh, that is where uh, uh, one of the leading indexes, you know, the S&P 500, the Dow, <clears throat> or the NASDAQ uh, will uh, bolt higher, uh, usually 1.4% and greater on a pickup in volume. So we'll wait for that and uh, also uh, look at the leading stocks and see how they're faring uh, during this uh, correction. So a lot of investing is uh, waiting patiently for the right market uh, to get aboard uh, the best stocks as they're breaking out of bases. So thanks for listening and uh, good luck.